How's it going, everybody? Moose here. Looks like I got some uh, commotion going on down the street. I was just getting ready to head out to go do some uh, slow maneuver practicing. I had to go down to Brooklyn real quick and grab some stuff. And we got fire trucks and ambulances and stuff. Not, not next door. Hopefully everybody's all right. I mean, it's nothing serious. Unfortunately, I had to drive by it because that's the way I got to go. Oh shit. How the hell'd that get up there? Wow. There's a car up in our neighbor's yard. Son of a bitch. That's different. I'm guessing somebody hit that turn going a little too fast. Wow. Well, there you go. Probably texting and driving. I don't know that for sure. It's just my guess, but uh, <laughs> I curve sharp, but it ain't that sharp. You didn't hit that damn thing going a good clip to end up out of the yard. Hopefully everyone inside the car is okay and doing all right. I am on my way to a empty parking lot somewhere. I'm not sure which one yet to do some slow speed maneuvering practice. My cable seven's got me inspired to do so. I do pretty good with my slow maneuvers, but there's always room for improvement. I want to get a lot better at U-turns and whatnot, so I figure I'll go down and see what I can do. Nope. Oh, oh, we got a fire too. Great. Somebody's burning shit. Well, at least everybody seems to be all right at the house, so that's good. Weird spot for a car to end up, though. I must say. Waving at the mopeds. That's right, you're on two wheels, you're good with me. I think I'll go over to my old stomping grounds. Or better known as the place I went to high school that I haven't been in years. They got a pretty good sized parking lot. I just want to do some turns and stuff and see uh, if I can improve upon my skill set. I think there's always room for improvement. So that's what I'm going to do today. I'm going to go over and turn things around and try not to drop nothing. We'll see how that goes. I just wanted to turn it on and share the amusement with you and the fun of the car exit next door. It's good times. All right. Well. Till next time, keep it safe, keep it upright, and keep the dirty side down, all right? This is Moose. I'll be talking at you. See ya. Me again. Here we go by Lake Columbia on the way to the school. That's where it's at. It's a nice curvy road. It's uh, populated, so I'm not going to get carried away, but... Of course, I don't own a gold wing, so, you know, I can't lean that far. <laughs> I see my Kaylee 7 out there rocking his uh, maneuvering tests. Doing good there, Mikey. So that bike's going to suit you well, my friend. Yeah, it was one of our curvier roads we have around here. The speed limit's real low, though, because it's very populated. The lake's right there. It's a man-made lake, Lake Columbia. It's dug out, and uh, I used to go dam sliding there, actually. Uh, well, I did it once. I almost killed myself. <sighs> yeah, you want to go dam sliding? Sure, let's go. Oh, my God. I fucking thought I was going to die. I almost got sucked right underneath the dam. That wouldn't have been cool. I couldn't have been much more than 12 or 13, I bet. That was a long time ago. Yep, nice curvy road. Oh, Lake Columbia. Lakes of lakes. Made by people.
enjoyed by people too. That is our Lake Columbia right there to my right. The road is to my left. I also wrecked a car over here years back. Oh, well, 16. That was on Turk Road, which is coming up here on our left. Going the other way, coming toward the school. My dad was pissed, to say the least. No bad, bad. And up here on my left is the high school I attended in my teenage years. This is the place that made me who I am today. Well, I don't know if it made me who I am, but it's the place I went to school and where I learned my social skills, which kind of explains a lot. Holy crap, it changed a lot. Wow. That parking lot used to all be connected. Hmm. I'll be damned. All this used to be one lot, too. Wow. Used to be able to get through this whole thing. That's something. Changed it up that much. Got rid of the whole parking lot. Look at the entrance. Wow, I haven't been over here in like 15 years. I don't think. I think last time I was here... I uh, wonder why they got it blocked off. Seems kind of stupid. Used to be able to get through the whole damn parking lot. I wonder drive a car over here in this parking lot. Yep, sure did. What do we got going on over here? Hmm. Hmm. Be damn. Some kind of little racing thing. Cool. I bought hot through there once. My Trans Am. Sure did. Well, I guess we'll go back to the main lot over there on the left because there's only two cars in it. This is big enough for me to do what I want to do. There's people everywhere over here. This is just a populated area. People live here. <laughs> All right, we'll flip a bitch here and. Be on our way back. One you turn down. Oh, foul. Hmm. I'll be damned. This place has changed a lot since I was a kid. Wow. Who'd have thunk it? Who'd have thunk it changed that much? So you used to be able to go on this lot, get through all the way through all those lots, all the way to the other side. Now they each have their own entrances. This makes no sense to me at all. I don't understand that reasoning. Why would you separate the parking lots? This is to all be parking lot right here. Pavement seems kind of slick. Eighteen turn. Eighteen foot turn. Uh huh. I got this shit down, baby. You know what I'm doing? Maybe I don't need no practice. Maybe I just have it. Maybe I'm a natural. 
I'm not, but maybe I am. I'm not. All right, well, that was my little practice. I'm going to set an actual phone up over there on that pole, I think, and see what I look like in person on film where I can actually see my bike. Um, so, this is actually me saying, uh, till next time, keep it safe out there, alright? This is Moose, and I'll be talking at you. See ya. Bye.